Madison teacher accused of sexual assault of a student will likely face formal charges. This despite being released from the conditions of his bond. Our Kelly Arthur spoke with the Dane County District Attorney's Office today, and she's in the newsroom to explain. Kelly? The DA's office says while the charges police initially recommended for Faye have been dropped, that's only because the assistant DA on this case is still working on their investigation and they plan on filing formal charges in the future. Last month, Terry Fay was arrested for the sexual assault of a Madison student. The assault allegedly happened five years ago at Leopold Elementary when the victim was 10 years old. According to Fay's attorney, police say Fay assaulted the boy who wasn't one of his students while other kids were at recess. However, my understanding of Leopold and virtually every other elementary school is that they're busy buildings where people are in and out of classrooms throughout the day. Faye was placed on leave after his arrest. Flash forward to this Monday and the 50-year-old was released from the conditions of his bond on the initial charges. He's uh, at first very relieved, but uh, the quick second emotion is frustration that he was accused publicly and uh, basically have his reputation destroyed only to come to court and find out that there was no reason for it. However, the Dane County District Attorney's Office says there is likely a reason for it. And even though these recommended charges aren't being filed formally, that's simply because they still are working on their investigation with the Madison police and victim. Writing in a statement, MPD's Special Victims Unit continues to complete investigative tasks related to this case. When asked when formal charges would be filed, the Dane County Deputy District Attorney said it's unclear and will likely be next year. A spokesperson with the Madison Metropolitan School District says their role is to not speculate on the legal process and Faye will remain on leave pending those charges. Kelly Arthur in the newsroom. Kelly, thanks.